Hi guys, I'm Laura and welcome back to my channel. So the other day I went through the foreign section of my grocery store and I got a couple of snacks from France. So I thought it would be funny for me to try them on camera and show you my reactions and my opinions about them. So let's get into it. I got seven, seven different things and we're gonna start with this one so this is by the brand Casino and this one are called uh, Tuile aux Amandes so apparently there's something with almonds they're like almond cookies or something so I'm gonna try them let's see um, okay so they came in a bag and they look like this. And I'm gonna open them and try some. Mmm. They, they smell a lot like almonds. Mm. Ooh, they really they're really thin. I thought they will be like way thicker, but they're really really thin. I don't know. I mean, they're not bad, but they're not like the best cookies I've ever tried or anything. They're just like, like a sugar cookie. And then you got like that overwhelming flavor of the almonds because there's like a ton of almonds on top of it. Mm. Mm. I don't know. They're not my favorite right now, so mm. I'll give them like on a scale from one to ten. I'll give them I don't know, like around the six because they're not bad cookies, but they're not really good. Next, um, I'm gonna try these ones. Uh, these ones are called Barquette, and they're supposed to be strawberry flavored. So there you can see them. Uh, everything is from the same brand. Everything's from this brand, Casino, because that's the one that I have at my grocery store. Oh, that they, they came in. I expected like a long package, like the other one, but they came in like little packagings. And there's, I guess, there's three of those. Um, so let's see. I'm gonna open it. Uh, they came like this. So they came like six of each one on the pack. Uh, ooh. They look like right in, like, in the picture. They're like longer cookies with, I'm guessing, that strawberry jam in the middle. I waited for them to be like crunchy or like cookies like the other ones, but they are way softer. And the jam is pretty good. Mm. I really like the jam, it tastes a lot, a lot like strawberries. Mm. I do like this one better. I think this one I'll give it like... Mm, Probably a seven or something. They're pretty good. I like them. Mm. Next, I'm gonna try something salty because that one, the last one, was pretty sweet. So these ones are called gaufrette, and these ones are supposed to be filled with gouda cheese. Mm. To be honest, I've never tried gouda cheese before, but. I'm not that big of a fan of cheese. Um, I just like like mozzarella cheese, and that's it. So we'll see. So you get a big pack like this. And, ooh, oh god, they smell bad. Oh my gosh, 
that's a really smelly cheat. They look like this. They're like little balls, I'll say. Uh, they look like the, the outside is like a wafer kind of thing. And I'm guessing the inside is filled with cheese. Um, they, sm they smell pretty bad, I have to be honest about that. The outside tastes just like a wafer, like a wafer cookie, and then the inside is completely packed with cheese. Um, I've never tried Gouda cheese before, but I think I don't like it. I don't know, it, it just tastes like, like really salty cheese. I think I'm not a fan of Gouda cheese. <laughs> I'm gonna try something sweet now. So the next one is called Bato Shock. Um, they're supposed to be chocolat au lait, so that's milk chocolate. And by the picture, I'm guessing it's like a, I don't know, like a biscuit type of thing. And then filled with chocolate on the inside. So we'll see. I like, I really like the box of this one, like, um, you open it like this, it remembers me kind of like the Japanese things, uh, how are they called, uh, pokey, that are also like little sticks covered in chocolate, and the box opens like the same way, so, just as the strawberry ones, it came with three different packs, and, the pack has a line in the middle, so I'm guessing you have to cut over there. Let me see. Oh! I like that the packagings are really cute, but like simple to open. Um, so, oh, okay. They look like right like in the picture, but this one, I don't know if it's broken or what, but I can separate the chocolate from the biscuit and I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to do that or if mines are just broken or something but I'm, I'm gonna try them apart and then I'm gonna try them together mm. tastes good this is like really crunchy it tastes like the base of the almond cookies but less sweeter God, that's really good chocolate. Mm. I could probably eat the chocolate by itself. That's really good quality chocolate. It tasted better than I expected. Mm. This is really good. It tastes even better together than apart. Mm. This one is, a de is definitely a 10. This is a 10 out of 10. Oh, and I forgot to give a grade for this one, but these ones are definitely like one. I do not like Gouda cheese. Now I know it. But these ones, these ones are a 10. I love them. Mm. They're really good. They're really, really good. So, I'm gonna continue with something salty. These ones are crackers um, with tomate and olive, so tomato and olives. And to be honest, I do not like olives, so I don't even know why I grabbed this. I really like tomato flavor stuff, like tomato chips and stuff. I really like that, but I do not like olives. So I just hope this is not filled with an, with an olive inside. Fingers crossed. Um, you will see. So it comes in a pack. Okay. Oh, smells. 
I don't know, it smells like salt. It doesn't smell bad, but it doesn't smell good at <laughs> anyways. So, they look like this. They look like little pieces of bread. Look at that. And they have like, I'm guessing that's cheese on top or some kind of seeds. And I can see the little pieces of olive chopped on top, so. There's no olive inside, so that's good. Mm. It's not filled with anything inside. It's just like the ingredients are, oops, on top. I don't know. It doesn't taste like tomato at all, but it has like little pieces of what I think is oregano on top so it kind of that tastes like a pizza because I like to eat my pizza with oregano on top so to me it kind of kind of things taste like pizza but I don't know I cannot taste the olives so that's good because I don't like them but it doesn't taste like tomato, so... Mm. I don't know, to be honest. It's like that overwhelming um, flavor of the oregano. So it reminds me of pizza, but it doesn't taste like tomato or olives. So it shouldn't be called like that because it doesn't taste like any of the ingredients that are on the name. They're not bad, but I guess I've tried better things. So I don't know, I'll give them like a six, I'll say, because I'll eat them again. But they're not the best thing that I have tried. So then I have another sweet thing and this was the thing that I was most excited to try. These ones are called Biscuit Fouré and these ones are filled with noisette, so hazelnut. They look like this and I'm really really excited to try these ones because they look amazing and I love 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 hazelnut. So I have really high expectations for this and I hope it gets to my expectations. So it came like the first cookies we opened. They look so cute, look. They look so fluffy. Hmm. They smell good. They smell like like cake almost. Uh, so they're super fluffy. Like this. But they're hard. They're not they're pretty hard. Mm. So it's weird because the cookie is kind of hard and crunchy, but when you bite it, like the top and the bottom, like cracks together because uh, there's like air in the middle mm. so it makes it feel like it's pretty soft and it's completely filled with hazelnut I really like the feeling mm. the feeling is pretty good it does taste like hazelnut so if you try if you have tried um Nutella it kind of tastes like Nutella but less less sweeter mm, they're really good I love them I'll give these ones a 9 because they're pretty good but they're not as good as the little sticks with chocolate but they're pretty good And then last but not least, I have 
amande goofy mint so these ones are almonds and they're like like roasted almonds i'll say and they do they say they have a smoke flavor so i'm gonna try this one we'll see i really like almonds and i really like eating them like raw like this so it just looked like a normal almond just that they have kind of some spices on top mm. oh they do have a smoky flavor they have a pretty pretty strong smoky flavor but they're pretty good and they smell as well they're pretty good it's just weird because I didn't expect them to taste that much mm. but I like these ones they're pretty good this ones I'll give them um, I don't know like an eight I'll say they're pretty good I like them so my favorite thing was definitely this ones these ones were my favorite the chocolate was amazing and the cookie was pretty good as well but them together oh my god these ones were my favorite uh, I'll say together with the hazelnut ones that were pretty good as well and my least favorite one was definitely the Gouda cheese because the Gouda cheese filled things I did not like this that was it for this video so I really hope you enjoy it if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below and I'll see you in my next video bye